Hey everybody, I'm KK. I'm Kristen. Together we are KK Crochet. And today we have a question. I have a question. So this is a shorter video, hopefully. But my question is this. I, you know I've been working on blankets all year. Um, I'm kind of tired of doing blankets. Like, I'm happy to do the ones I have. I don't want to add any more. I'm already past my limit, I think. But, I'm trying to get these done for Christmas. But, I need something that I can donate. Yes, we take hats for donation, all that kind of stuff. I need something I can donate to other people. I have a an organization who takes up items, and if you've been here before, you probably know that right around October or November, I make a donation to a lo local organization, and they sell the items that we make at an auction. And that money goes to buy Christmas presents for kids in the area that are in need. And so I've done blankets before. I've made corner-to-corner -corner flags. Yes, C to C flags. I have made hats. I've made scarves, I think. I've made dishcloths for them to add to certain things. We've bought things and made baskets before for like kitty baskets and then made things like crayon holders to go in it and things. So hit us up down below and let us know what are some things that you make for donations that are good. I really don't want to make another blanket. I have so many blankets on the hook and I don't think I have time to make a blanket. I wish I had taken time before because and and generally when you make a blanket in this type of thing it doesn't always bring the kind of money that it, which it doesn't matter any money is good money right but generally it doesn't bring the amount of money it costs for the yarn and I don't in general care if I have time to make one to do that because like I said money is money but if they can get a few smaller items that will still bring them in the same amount of money or more and it takes less time, then I'd rather do those things. Same things that are more, it seems like blankets here are not a high commodity and it may be because it's November when they do it and it's not quite cold enough here yet to really be thinking that way. It's cold, but it's not like freezing cold usually. Usually we haven't gotten our first snow until probably after they do this because I think it's the first part of November. So. Anyway, let us know but down below, what is your favorite thing to donate? Do you donate to auctions like this? Do you donate to places that auction off or sell your items for their own purposes and charity purposes? And let us know what went well for you. What did, I know it's different for every area, but I'm just kind of, um, my brain is kind of not working right now. And I have put it off instead of focusing on that. I've been focused on other things and honestly kind of forgot about having to donate to it. It's in the back of my brain. But I honestly kind of forgot to plan because I was planning for Christmas extravaganza and these blankets. So I kind of got off track. So hit me up with your quick and easy makes that I could make to send to them. Um, yeah, let me know what you think. All right, Miss Kristen, what about you? What about me? Do you have an idea? I don't know. I kind of stopped on ideas for that. How about a question of the day? Um, what's your favorite cereal? Hmm, Lucky Charms because it's gluten free. If it wasn't for that, it would be, um, probably like Golden Grahams. Yeah, it has Golden to be gluten free. Yeah. Yep. Okay, don't forget to be kind because you don't know about sister. Let us know a donation down below, please. I need your help. Bye. Bye.